Special thanks to our friends at Best Buy Mobile who are hooking us up with not one, but two Moto Droid Verizon Android phones to give away to two uh, lucky viewers, lucky players of the OnePod Bandit. Best Buy Mobile, what's cool about them is they have no hassle pricing, no rebates to deal with, no forms to forget to send in. You go into the store, you buy your phone, you pay your price, that's it. Your rebate's incorporated at the price you pay at the register. You leave, you're done, no rebates to worry about. So check it out, Best Buy Mobile again, thanks. And stay tuned, One Pod Bandit, Moto Droid, we got them coming, all right? Just just trust me on that one. Boxing. The car, both the home dock and the car dock were kind of cool. No pricing set yet on these. Uh, they'll be available as separate accessories. But they're kind of cool because the car dock was a windshield mount, but it also, when you dock the phone into it, uh, it activates a car-based UI, which has icons uh, that let you quickly get to things like navigation, which you want to use in the car. The home dock, similarly, um, if I put the phone back on the home screen and I dock the phone, so you can see it's just the USB dock, and the dock, all the dock has on it is uh, a USB port on the back. I kind of was hoping there would be an audio, you know, a line-out audio pass-through, but there's not, which is too bad. But anyway, so I docked the phone. Kind of hard to do when I'm holding it here in my hand. I should really just set it down. But there you go. So you dock the phone and automatically, the multimedia station, you get the little icon in the corner connected to the multimedia station. See? And if I go back, it automatically goes into multimedia mode. So it's finding the location for weather, and I don't think I have GPS. I don't know if I have GPS turned on here. Oh, I do. So there you go. And you get your home screen thing with the multimedia dock in. So you get a big clock, you get your weather widget, you get one touch to go to your music player, go back, you get one touch to go to your multimedia gallery, I don't have anything in there, one touch dimming, so if you use it as a bedside table and you're very sensitive like I am about light at night, seriously I have to turn everything down. I had an alarm clock a while ago, I had to uh, take back to the store because it was too bright at night. Anyway, um, you can dim it and then you can also uh, adjust your alarm clock there on one touch. So that's kind of neat, kind of a nice little thing. Uh, go to the weather widget and pretty cool. I know people will definitely like that. And then the car dock, similar as well. So again, no pricing yet on the dock accessories. Going to get that very soon for you. But there you go, first glance. You know what? Let's, uh, since it's got this fancy camera, uh, Android 2.0 supporting advanced camera functionality, including uh, digital zoom and flash and all that kind of stuff. It's got a nice little drawer interface there for your camera settings. So we'll leave all that stuff the way it is. We'll take a picture because it lasts longer. And then we'll dock the phone. That's a goofy picture, man. And then we'll go to the uh, media player. Oh, look, it's a terrible, terrible uh, picture of me behind the camera. But there you go.